Boom. Yay. Dixling. Hey. Boom. Hello there. Welcome back to Pokemon Silver. No one called us this time in the beginning? This is... This is a miracle. Or maybe it's because we're in a cave and we don't have any reception or something like that. I don't know. Oh, wild Pokemon. Yes, there are wild Pokemons here. A Cubone again. Hello. Hmm. Another Cubone. Let's just throw a ball at it and see what happens. I'll buy more balls when I get to the next town. Because last Cubone I tried to paralyze and then it fled, so... Haha! Start this episode good! Catching a Cubone! Mm, lonely! <laughs> it always wears the skull of its dead mother. So no one has any idea what its hidden face looks like. Poor, poor Cubones. Yes, so we'll have a nickname. We'll call him... Um, okay, G something. Gl... Ooh, that could be item. Nope, okay. That could be item. Nope, okay. Nope. Even more what? That was just a little dude, dude. I skipped it for you guys. Yeah. That was just a little dude, dude. I skipped it for you guys. And up. Hmm. Oh. That was just a little dude, dude. I skipped it for you guys. Ooh, item. Up there. Ooh, wait. This could. No. Okay. Oh. No. That was just a little dude, dude. I skipped it for you guys. Ah! That was a cube bomb. Uh, okay, which way do I? Oh, north, north, definitely north. Revive, nice. Revives are always good. I, I do think I have some already. The question is, do I have some repel or something like that? Because I don't really need to catch anything in here, and I don't really get any training from them. They're like level ten to fifteen. Anything, nope. Nothing whatsoever. I guess I'll just have to do a lot of editing out then. Yay, great. Okay, so that's the way out. Yeah. Ooh, Nyx. I guess we could catch an Onyx. That would be great. Maybe it can't attack. For a parrot. I don't know why I haven't caught Pokemon before. I don't remember how why I when I played this game previously to starting it up again. God damn it, Onyx! You're gonna find me, Rock Snake. Coils around a Cobra Snake, a normal snake. Hmm. Hmm. I, I can't remember what Onyx is based on actually. I never really thought about that. Is it just supposed to be like a snake made of rock, or is it based on some sort of thing? I mean, like, as you can see, a tarb uh, Arbok is it's even named after it, a cobra. It's based on a cobra. But then Onyx is just like, oh, rock snake. Yes, good. Ah, oh, god damn it. Screech! Ugh. Release from bind. Well, that isn't that great. That was such a big threat. The Onyx is paralyzed! And... And... God damn it! Free pairs! <laughs> Just... Get it, get it! Down. In. Oh. Mm. Damn it. Oh, well, I guess this is the only other Pokémon I could find in here, so let's just use the last Ultra Ball and even the Moon Ball if this doesn't work. And then, I guess we'll have to kill it, because it doesn't obey me. Maybe he wants the Moon Ball. Excuse me, uh, Mr. Onyx, do you want the Moon Ball? I, I, I couldn't really hear you. Uh, I'll give it to you and then you will tell me. Do you want uh, this? This moon ball? That is not made for you, but do you want it anyway? Grey green ball? Do you? No, okay. Fine! Then I guess you'll die. Or at least faint. Uh, 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 uh. A 
and you will do it by earthquake. There we go. Go down, Onyx. Get out of my sight. I don't like you. You, you refuse to be caught, even when paralyzed. Goodbye. Nothing there. Okay, down here. Okay. Oh, wait. Huh? Max potion. Great. That could be useful. And there's an item at least. Did I check this? Okay, nothing in there. Then. Oh. Oh, there's a cube. A uh, cube bone. PP up. Yeah, I can't carry any more items. Let us. Uh, let us go to the bottom here and uh, use uh, my uh, potion. On a tarb. There we go. Now I got the room for this. Nope. Oh, PP up. Very good. I don't know exactly what move to use that on just quite yet, so... We'll wait with that. This is a very long uh, cave. Kinda. This rock tunnel, right? Ooh! ex defend I don't care about that anyway. That's just for selling. Ooh, but this... Maybe... Another cube bone. And... Team 47! Huh! What is... What is team... Nope! Damn it, I didn't want to use whatever assigned to the select button. I used the bike. Barely used that, actually. Here we go. 47, 47, 47, 47. Steel wing. Well, that's kind of an unuseful move. <laughs> it's like a move for bird types. It was just a little gear, dude. I skipped it for you guys. Uh, yeah, the steel wing, it's for bird types. Uh, flying types, I mean bird types. Uh, yeah, flying type, and it's super effective against types that are super effective against flying types. Uh, I, rock and steel. I mean rock and ice. So it's... Uh, sure, it could be good, but... I eh, don't care about the elixir. But the ones you're facing are probably super effective against you as well. Oh, we're out. Route 10, so we're gonna the Lavender Town. Yes, we are out. Oh, hello, trainer. <laughs> Hiker Jim wants to bow. Oh, hi there. I'm a champ. Well, I'm a poison type, so I'm okay. I'm totally okay. But I don't have anything super effective against you. So I guess Earthquake will do. Karate shop! Carrot tea shop! Yeah, right. Almost forgot about that one. Until I didn't, because I just said, oh, hey! Never mind, I'm just being a little bit... Uh, weird today. As with every day. <sighs> Tarab gains 6 p. <laughs> that was a... Badly impersonation. No, eh, I don't know. Hey, fever is making me sneeze. <laughs> okay, let's go down here. Oh, another guy. Hello there. Probably another hiker. They usually use the same sprites. You like Pokemon, don't you? Me too. Well, Mr. Creepy. Ooh, it's a- no, it was a Pokefan. Robert. Yes. A Quagsire. Water, ground, yeah, we'll do headbutt there. Headbutt. Headbutt is good. Flinch? Oh. Eh, yeah, well, water gun. 12 damage, I think. I think I was at 102. You guys can go back and check, I cannot. I'll know when editing. Uh, and usually wh when I say like... When I say, oh, I can go back and... God damn it. Using a battery that was completely unnecessary. Yeah, usually when I say like, oh, I will see that when I edit. I... I don't notice it until I hear myself saying here, uh, I'll see it when I edit. And then I feel like, should I go back and check it while editing? And I'm like, no. <laughs> it's usually not important enough. I'd, uh, I 
have, I'd have to say, that's my loss. Voice for sale, voice for sale, voice for sale, voice for sale. Oh, Gina calls me out. Hi, I'm Big C, this is Gina, how are things doing to battle? Everyone wants to battle. Like before, when I was in Johto, no one ever, everyone just called and said random stuff. Now that I'm in Kanto, I, I can't go back now, but now that I'm here, everyone wants to battle. Isn't that a bit weird? Lavender Town, hello, with a weird music. You need a Poke Flu to wake sleeping Pokemon. Every trainer has to know that. That's quite some building, eh? It's Kanto's radio tower. Hmm. Lavender Town, the noble purple town. I guess this. The ceiling of this house is, I mean, the roof of these houses are purple, but not more than that. Lavender Volunteer Pokemon House. Uh, let's just go fix things in here first. To the north of Lavender is uh, Rock Tunnel. Go through it to get to the power plant. Already been there, took the other way. There's a radio program that plays Poke Flute music. Oh, uh, your radio card needs a... EXPN card to tune into it. We need an EXPN card then, I guess. The director of the radio station sure was happy. He said they're back on the air because the power plant is running smoothly again. Also, this guy probably had some other uh, lines when the power was still off. <laughs> and we missed it completely. Yes, please. Heal my Pokemon. <laughs> okay, we'll go. We'll go and explore the city now for the last part of... Oh, wait, 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 Mark. Last part of this episode, we'll just go around in the city. Repel is a necessity if you are going to explore a cave. Even though I like exploring, I still haven't made it into all the caves. Okay. Yeah, I guess I'll get some. I heard about a craftsman who makes custom Pokeballs in the Yoto town of Azalea. I wish I had some. Well, I just used my last one on the Moonball, on that stupid Onyx. Kurt is the person that we're talking about here. Okay, let's get to selling here! Let's go down all the way down, no, 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 Nugget! It's made for selling! Go away! Yes! It's okay. And I have a few other things. Yeah, sure, I'll sell you the upgrade. I'm not gonna be able to use it anyway. Uh, anything else? Metal coat? Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to use metal coat. And Okay, and then I'll buy some stuff here. Uh, you only say great, sell great balls? Well, I guess it's better than... No! No, 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 I want more. Better than nothing. We'll buy a few great balls there. Yeah, great. And some max repulse. Would have preferred normal repulse, but... Now we have in case we run into one of those places again where there's a lot of weak Pokemon that I don't need to fight. And before, just before ending this episode, I'm gonna go to the PC and actually deposit some items that I will not be using. Vixie's PC! Access to old PC! Do I have any? Oh yeah, I have two moonstones in there. Uh, deposit. I'm not gonna use the Nevermelt Ice. Uh, let's see, a Dragon Fang. Nope, not gonna use that. Not gonna use the Amulet Coin. And what will focus band and cleanse tag? That should be it. Uh, I guess I could have used the cleanse tag as a repel in the cave, but eh, it was time. Anyway, I'm gonna have to end this episode here. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you next time. Goodbye!